Okay, so it's close to the end of the week. I've completed both days of my physical activities for the week, and I'm ready to do my assignment. Okay, so again, here's the introduction directions uh, as I went over in the last video. On the Google Form, I'm going to click the next button to go to my next page. Okay. It's going to start off with a simple all right, name. Your first name will be Mr. Your last name. For me, it's Mr. Cuevas. What period is your phys ed class? Any, mini, mini, mo. This does not indicate favoritism, but I'm going to pick my sixth grade boys class. Right now, they're all saying, great job, Mr. Cuevas. Okay. Now, make sure you click, click the correct class. Okay. Here, please find a quote that is meaningful to you and complete the two questions below. This is going to be worth three points. So please find a quote that's meaningful to you and type it in the box below. So I'm going to keep my quote nice and simple for today. Live like a champion. Okay. Second question is, why is this quote meaningful to you? This must be four complete sentences. So I'm not going to write four full sentences for you, but I expect four well thought out, complete, grammatically correct, good spelling, right? all the good stuff. Really tell me why you picked that quote. Once you finish that, you're going to click to go on to the next se section. Okay, so now we're actually going to talk about the physical activity you did throughout the week. Again, engage in some type of physical activity for at least 30 minutes. The activities act it should be safe and appropriate, parental guardian approval, right? everything I went over in the last video. So what day did you perform activity number one? So activity number one for me was on Monday. Okay, this activity was in minutes, was 90 minutes, so it was an hour and a half. Okay, specifically, what was the activity? This was cycling. Okay, my, my neighbor invited me for a bike ride. Yes, we did stay six feet apart. What equipment did you use, if anything? My bike, my helmet, okay, and my smartwatch. Okay, where did you participate? This was all over the eastern end of Long Island. Okay, so I'm just going to write Suffolk County to the North Shore. Okay, what areas of health related fitness okay, did this activity improve? Now, we're talking about cycling. Remember, cycling, heart, cardiovascular endurance was a yes. Uh, muscular endurance, we did have some big hill climbs. All right, so I'm going to leave it at those two for now. What areas of skill-related fitness did this activity improve on? Okay, if you forget about these, you could always go back to my notes that we went over in class. But cycling, we had some speed, okay, especially on the downhills. Not really agility because we're stationary on the bike. There was some power, okay, balancing on the bike, coordination while shifting gears, and definitely reaction time on the bike because, you know, cars pulling out, you got to be safe. Once I fill that in, I'm going to click the next book, next tab, and that's going to bring me into my second session. Okay, so the second session, which activity did you do? That was on Tuesday for me. How many minutes? 30 minutes. Make sure that you type the number in. Okay, this was a boxing class. Okay, Mrs. Regan is also doing this. Uh, I believe Mr. Viola has even given that class a try on Beach Body On Demand. Where did you participate? This was at home. Okay, and this activity included muscular endurance, strength, endurance, and flexibility. What areas of skill-related fitness did this activity improve upon? We did touch upon speed, agility, power, balance, coordination, and reaction time. So this was a great workout. It addressed all areas of my skill-related fitness. The last part of this is going to be why did you choose this specific activity? Okay, this was just the next class in my program and it was a lot of fun okay is there a specific fitness or sports related goal that you're working towards complete the six week program and improve all areas of fitness Okay, so now I've fully submitted all my answers. This is the end of the week. I've done both of my workouts. I've completed the Google form to the best of my ability. Now I'm going to click the submit button. All right, and that's it. So I hope you guys are all well and safe, and I hope you guys do a great job. Talk to you next time.